In this video, I'm going to show you how to update your firmware for your camera, uh, for your, specifically for the Dawa IP camera. Um, first, you want to go to dawawiki.com and search for the model number. And then once you have that, this is the firmware, download it. I've downloaded it already and I've moved it into this folder. Next thing is if you're working with the VMS, such as Milestone, you want to right click on the recording server and stop the recording server service as well as the management server service you want to stop that uh, because you don't want you don't want the uh, well you don't want it to try to continue to access this camera when it's offline so um, it will be offline for at least a minute maybe two uh, during the uh, firmware up upload pro or uh, update process so um, the easiest way to update the firmware is by opening the config tool, searching for the cameras on your network. You may have to update the password. And that's So it'll basically search for the DAWA devices on your network using that username and password. These are the three cameras with that model number. And I'm gonna do uh, basically a device upgrade so select these devices and upgrade file path is going to be this one here i guess i have to actually go to my dropbox here uh, let's see Select the file, and looks like looks like we have to select the file for all of them. And by the way, you can tell um, which firmware you have. Two point eight two. And I'm uploading 2.84. So you, as long as the firmware that you're uploading is newer than what you had before, then it will work. If not, don't try to upload a firmware that's older because that might break the camera. And I'm going to click on Batch Upgrade. I don't know why it's asking for Upgrade File Path again, but I will go ahead and select it. And you'll see here that I'm updating the firmware of multiple cameras at once. Once it's fully done upgrading, then you can expect it to basically reset itself and it'll come back online, at which point the camera will be available and you should check your recorder and uh, make sure that everything is online and working properly, which I'm actually going to do now. So we're using Milestone Smart uh, X Protect. And we're waiting for 
three cameras to come back online. Let's give it a second. I'm going to pause the video. So the first one just came online, the second one, and this one's actually uh, not that model number. This is the other model number. So this one, this one, and this one, they all just came back online. And uh, that's how you uh, update the firmware.